All right, so apparently we are getting a summonable LR Super Boo. Uh, honestly, when I first saw the notification on my phone from Twitter, uh, I didn't get a close look at the picture, right? So I thought it was actually an LR Kid Boo, and I got super excited, and then I saw it was Super Boo, and I was like, okay, that's still pretty cool. That's still great, but it's not quite what I wanted. I mean, we're getting closer though, right? Uh, Kid Boo now has to be... Maybe not around the corner, but maybe sometime this year, right? With LR Super Blue now in the game, I feel like it's it's on the horizon. So, uh, anyways, with that said, in today's video, we are going to be checking out the full details and animations for this LR Kid Boo. Sorry, LR Super Boo to find out how good he is and all that good stuff. So, uh, with all that said, let's jump right into it. Uh, before we get into the details provided by of course the homie Goresh let's watch these animations so I'm going to pause my music I'm gonna throw on some earbuds here and let's go Oh my god, that, um, that active skill animation is terrifying. That, I mean, like, Super U has always been kind of scary to me, but that active skill, man, was extra, extra scary. Uh, so, love that. Uh, otherwise, the super attack animations look good. They look good. Um, clearly, the 12 key is an attack all super, as you can tell, right? It's attacking and hitting multiple enemies, so that's interesting as well. Yeah, uh, overall, very, very good animations, uh, especially... Especially this active skill, man. Yeah, that close-up right there. That close-up right there. It's terrifying. Okay, so moving on to the details now. Once again, a big shout-out and thank you to the homie Goresh for providing us with these translations. And let's start with the leader skill, which is Majibu Saga and Heavenly Events. Category key plus 4, HP attack and defense plus 150%. 12 key super attack raises attack and defense for one turn and causes colossal damage. Oh, sorry. Uh, did I get them mixed up? So it looks like the 18 key is attack call and the 12 key is single target. Okay, so yeah, 12 key, uh, colossal damage and greatly lowers defense. And then the 18 key is the assault rain, which is raises attack and defense for one turn and causes mega colossal damage to all enemies with a medium chance to stun. And then the passive is... Uh, activates the entrance animation once only and gains key plus 5 and attack and defense plus 120% for 4 turns upon first appearance. Attack and defense plus 120% at the start of turn gains an additional attack and defense plus 30% when attacking if HP is 30% or more. And then gains an additional attack plus 30% when attacking if HP is 60% or more gains an additional attack and defense plus 30% when attacking if HP is 90% or more. Great chance to guard all attacks, and then guard activated against all attacks if there is a Majin Buu Saga or Fused Fighter category enemy performs an additional attack that has a high chance to become a super attack during the turn when guard is activated, temporarily gains an additional attack plus 100% for this character's next attack after receiving an attack, gains an additional key plus 1, 
and defense plus 20% for each attack received, max of key plus 7, and defense plus 140%. So I know that's a lot to take in, but uh, basically from what I can tell, he's going to be getting a lot of attack, so he will be hitting very hard. And uh, defensively, he's going to start off solid, decent in the beginning, but he's going to get much better defensively after you uh, take some attacks and build up that defense. And uh, especially, especially if you're facing a Majibu Saga or Fused Fighter enemy, then he's going to get that Guaranteed Guard, which is awesome. And uh, even without the Guaranteed Guard, it's a 70% chance to guard. So, um, you know, more often than not, he will be guarding for most turns, right? And you get the additional attack, which has a 50% chance to become a super attack. Um, and of course, this additional 100% attack after receiving an attack is uh, gonna make a massive difference. Like that turn when you get this 100% boost, you're gonna be doing stupid, stupid amounts of damage. So um, yeah, he's looking pretty good so far. Now let's move on to the active skill, which uh, massively raises attack temporarily and causes ultimate damage, recovers 40% HP, and disables the enemy's action once within the turn. And it can be activated uh, once five or more turns have elapsed in battle, and HP is 60% or below once only. Okay, so um, a pretty decent condition. I think this 60% HP restriction is a little bit uh, much. You know, I feel like 60% is kind of low, but uh, it's not terrible. It's like an okay condition. And links are Brutal Beatdown, Metamorphosis, Majin, Infinite Regeneration, Fear and Faith, Fierce Battle, and Legendary Power. And categories are Majin Buu Saga, Heavenly Event, Transformation Boost, Artificial Life Form, Majin Power, Power Absorption, Sword Enemies, Worldwide Chaos, and Exploding Rage. Okay, so of course the main thing that's missing from the links is big bad bosses um that would have made a pretty substantial difference but even without big bad bosses he's still going to be getting a lot of attack from his links if you're linking him with like other boo units so i don't think it's a massive issue not having big bad bosses and uh yeah overall i think this is a good unit I think this is a really good unit. Is he like mad broken um, for today's standards? I don't think so. Of course, I don't know for sure until I've had a chance to test him out myself, but just on paper, I think he's going to be very strong, especially offensively and defensively. I think he'll be able to hold his own on most events. So yeah, overall a really, really good unit. And um, yeah, that's how I feel about it. Let me know in the comments down below how you guys feel about this unit, what you guys think about him based on the details we see here. And uh, let me know if you're excited, if you're hyped for his release, if you're going to be summoning for him. And that's basically going to do it for the video, guys. That is the LR Super Boo, hopefully Kid Boo, sooner than later. We'll see. Uh, thank you, Goresh, for the translations. And uh, thank you guys, of course, for watching, as always. If you liked today's video, then make sure to like the damn video, sub to the channel if you're new, hit that notification bell so that YouTube knows you want to stay up to date with all my latest content. And until next time, have an awesome, awesome day. I'm Tiger with Tiger Uppercut Media, signing out.